just one screw left. Oh, this is a good, uh, a good trick if you need to put things on your your um, counters so that they don't slide around. You have some of little, it's like gum almost, little tapes, things that you put on plants and what have you, and they just stick. And that'll move around so that's a pretty handy handy thing uh let's see and i think oh there's two screws left so i have to use my use my head literally to uh, get these unscrewed So that's the thing with these do-it-yourself jobs. Oftentimes they're not hard. They're sometimes awkward, though. And uh, when you don't have another pair of hands, it can make it a little bit more of a challenge. But flathead piece wasn't quite the right one. I mean not my flathead, my my Phillips head. I think maybe this one will work a little bit better. Hopefully you can still see what's going on. Now I'm using my head again to hold the balance up why there are two screws left. Once I get these two screws out, the balance will come down. I'll be able to replace the blind. No problem. Yeah, maybe a screw gun would have been better too. I mean, I don't have the best tools all the time. I have what I have. So, uh, all right, I think it's loose now. There it is. So, there's the blind. out from the balance replace it. Let's see. We gotta take my shoes off. I have a bunch of items underneath the table here. And that's another good piece of advice. You know, make sure you have a good working working environment first and good tools. Sometimes, oftentimes, I like to just get busy with it. And that's not always the best answer, but it's my answer oftentimes because I get it done that way. So, let's see. Just a couple screws that hold hold this this blind up inside the balance. So I've just got to find them. Here's one. And I'm sure 
there is a way to do this. Oh. So now you're going to learn something that I did not know. i got to show you this. So there are just clips in here. You don't have to take your whole balance off. They're just these clips. If you pull these clips out, undo the clip. And there's another clip over here. The blind will come out. See, now you just learned something that I didn't know. It would have made it a whole lot easier. Instead of taking the whole balance out, just take the clips out. So you can see how easy that would be to replace your own blind. Just order it. In my case, I ordered it from Thor. These clips are holding it in. Take the clips, take the blind out of the clips, replace it, and you're good to go. So let me do that. Wow. See? I learn something all the time. <laughs> That's why, part of the reason why I have these videos is so you don't have to learn it the hard way. I apparently will continue to do that. Every time I work on this RV, I learn something new every time, like this, that I did not know that the clips were holding it in, and, you know, maybe I should have, I don't know, but I didn't, and so, but the good thing is, is every time I work on it, and I learn something, then I know how to fix it that much faster in the future should it happen on the road which does on occasion occur all right this clip doesn't want to release 